The year was 2015. Ian Patrick Batungbako, a young man with eyes that held the promise of forever, met Angeline Marie Amil Suizo, a woman whose laughter could chase away the darkest clouds. Their souls intertwined like the melodies of a love song, their hearts beating in unison from the moment their eyes met. They vowed to hold on to each other, come what may, their love a beacon in the storm. Forever, they whispered, the promise carried on the wind, echoing through the years to come. Their love story wasn't a fairy tale, it was real, raw and beautiful. They faced challenges head on, their bond only strengthening with each obstacle overcome. Their love was a safe haven, a warm embrace in a world that often felt cold. They found joy in the simple things, sharing a cup of coffee on a rainy morning, the way their laughter mingled as they watched the sunset, the unspoken language of their love that transcended words. They painted their love story across the canvas of their lives, each shared moment a vibrant hue. Movie nights curled up on the couch, popcorn forgotten as they lost themselves in each other's eyes. Adventures in new cities, hand in hand, exploring hidden alleyways and stealing kisses under the Eiffel Tower. Quiet evenings at home, the soft strum of Ian's guitar filling the air as Angeline hummed along, her head on his shoulder. Their love was a tapestry woven with threads of laughter, passion and unwavering support. They celebrated each other's victories as their own and offered comfort and strength during times of need. Their love was a constant, a source of strength and inspiration, proof that true love could weather any storm. But fate, it seemed, had other plans. In the spring of 2016, tragedy struck, casting a dark cloud over their shared universe. Angeline, the love of Ian's life, his soulmate, his everything, was taken too soon. The world as he knew it shattered, leaving behind a void that threatened to swallow him whole. Grief, sharp and relentless, threatened to consume him. Yet, even in the depths of his despair, Ian clung to the promise they had made. He would love her forever. He would keep her memory alive in his heart, in every beat, in every breath. He would honor their love by living a life that would make her proud. And so, with a heavy heart but an unyielding spirit, Ian began to navigate a world without Angeline by his side. Every sunrise was a painful reminder of her absence. Every sunset a poignant echo of their shared dreams. But Ian refused to let the darkness win. He would love her beyond the boundaries of life and death. He would keep their love story alive. Each year, on their anniversary, he would celebrate their love, the joy they shared, the unbreakable bond they forged. He would visit their special places, the cafes where they shared whispered secrets, the park bench where he first told her he loved her. He would trace the inscription on her headstone, forever yours, a promise whispered on the wind, echoing in his soul. Each year, on the anniversary of her passing, he would write her a letter, pouring out his heart, sharing his life, his dreams, his fears. He would speak to her photos, sharing stories of his day, laughing at inside jokes only they understood. He would dance to their song, tears streaming down his face, his heart aching with her absence, yet full of an enduring love that death couldn't touch. He kept her memory alive through acts of kindness, volunteering at a local hospice, offering comfort to those who understood his pain. He carried her spirit with him, her laughter echoing in his heart, her love guiding his path. He lived a life filled with purpose, knowing that she was watching over him, proud of the man he had become. Section 6, The Language of Flowers. He spoke to her through the language of flowers, leaving lilies, her favorite, her grave, their sweet fragrance a reminder of her gentle spirit. He would sit by her grave for hours, sharing his hopes, his dreams, his fears. He would talk about their future, the one they had planned, the one he would now live for both of them. He found solace in their shared memories, in the knowledge that their love story, though tragically cut short, would forever be etched in the stars. He imagined her laughter echoing on the wind, her hand reaching out to touch his cheek. He felt her presence in the warmth of the sun, in the gentle caress of a summer breeze. He carried her love with him, a guiding star in the darkness, a beacon of hope in a world that often felt cold and unforgiving. Section 7, Whispers Across Time. Years turned into decades, yet Ian's love for Angeline remained as strong as ever. The world around him changed, technology advanced at an astonishing pace, but his heart remained tethered to her memory. He embraced the future, knowing that she would want him to live a full and happy life, but he never forgot the past, the love they shared, the promises they made. 
He found new ways to honor her memory, donating to research for the disease that took her from him, establishing a scholarship in her name for aspiring artists, her passion burning bright through their talent. He shared her story with anyone who would listen, a testament to the enduring power of love, a beacon of hope in a world that often felt lost and alone. Section 8. A Love Story Etched in Stars By 2100, Ian was a man aged by time but not by heartbreak. His hair was silver, his face etched with the lines of a life well lived, but his eyes still held the same love, the same spark that ignited when he first looked at Angeline. He embraced the advancements of the future, using holographic technology to revisit their memories, to walk hand in hand with her image in their favorite places, to hear her voice once more, a bittersweet symphony of love and loss. He shared their story with his grandchildren, their great-grandchildren, keeping her memory alive for generations to come. He taught them the importance of love, the power of commitment, the beauty of a life lived with passion and purpose. He became a guardian of their love, a storyteller weaving a tapestry of devotion that transcended time and mortality. Section 9, Forever Entwined. As Ian lay on his deathbed, surrounded by the love of his family, his thoughts drifted back to Angeline. He closed his eyes, and in his mind's eye, he saw her, young and vibrant, her smile as radiant as the day they met. He reached out, his hand meeting hers, and in that moment, he knew that their love story wasn't ending. It was merely entering a new chapter. Their love, a love that transcended time and death, would continue to shine brightly, a beacon of hope for all who dared to believe in the enduring power of the human heart. Ian and Angeline, forever bound by a love that echoed through eternity, a testament to the promise whispered on the wind all those years ago, forever.